In this video, we will be solving this geometric question. The question is asking what percent of the area of triangle in the figure is shaded. So it's asking the shaded area to the ratio of shaded area to the big triangle. So the shaded green area, green area to big triangle. So we are asked in terms of percent. So that means once we find this ratio, we will find with 100 denominator. Uh, so we need to find respective number in the numerator. So this question can be solved in many different ways. Um, so we can calculate the height and define the areas respectively. But I will solve it with the similarity so imagine we have a height here and obviously it is a equilateral triangle and equilateral triangle has five units side lengths total so it is sharing the vertex of this 60 degree and this is a height and the height of the small triangle is similar to height of the big triangle side length of the small triangle is similar to side length of the big triangle so obviously we see that between the big triangle and the small triangle big triangle over small triangle ratio is five to one so we have five units on the side length and the one unit on the side length in the small triangle so we know that in triangle similarities if the side length is k k amount the side ratio is k amount the area ratio should be the square of the k k square if you are comparing volume with similarity volume ratio should be ra uh, k cube so this is a fact is a cube and we will be using this area ratio in this question so we know that the ratio is k um, is 5 which is 5 and the area comparison area of area of big triangle abt i will call it and to ratio of area of small triangle it should be 25 over 1 so square of both, both values so what does this mean if I have A, if I call the area of the small triangles A, this should be also A, this should be also A. So if how how do I talk about similarity by the way? Because of these this information, basis of the small triangles, this base is parallel to this base, this side length here. This is how we're talking about similarity. This is uh side information here. So the whole triangle should be 25a therefore if you subtract 25 and 3a we will find 22a is our green area so we can make comparison green area now to big triangle area so it will be big green area will be 25a minus 3a 22a we said so 22 a over big triangle we have 25a so the a's will cancel and as we said earlier we need to write denominator in 100 so if you multiply this by 4 the top should be multiplied by 4 so it will be 88 over 100 so this corresponds to 88 percent so this is our solution i hope you like this question and you enjoyed the solution if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you like to see these videos more, you can subscribe to our channel and I will see you in the next video. Bye.